Hey everybody, it's Patricia and welcome back to my channel. It's time to check in with my uh, project pan, the 70s pan, that 70s pan, that's the name of it. Uh, it is a panning project I'm doing with the Pantastic Ladies over on Facebook. I'll have all the info in the description down below, uh, but it's time to do a check-in. So I've got everything written down. I've got some things moving out, some things coming in. So I'm pretty excited about that. There are 70, 70, 70 prompts and, um, they recommended you pick seven. Start with seven prompts and then, but do it however you want. I picked seven prompts and I'm just gonna keep on with having seven. If I don't go through all the prompts, I'm okay with that. This is my first really big panning project I have ever done, uh, especially with the Pantastic Ladies. So, let's get started and see where I'm at. The first thing I had was uh, prompt number 20, which was fringe. And that's something that makes you look extra. And I chose my uh, Stila Glitter and Glow in Karma Kitten. Kitten Karma. Karma Kitten. Um, I haven't used this. Let me see. Yeah, it's still fine. I haven't used it. So it's going back in. This is to use up. I've got to use it. I have it sitting on my desk. But I'm not using it. So I need to... I need to use that product. Next, number five, lava lamps. Something liquid uh, or neon. So I chose my Marc Jacobs uh, face setting spray. And you can see, oh, it's dirty. It's sitting on my desk here. You can see where I started, where I was last time. I'm gonna put a new mark. I use this every single time I put on my makeup. Every single time. And it just seems like it's taking forever for it to go down. But now I only use it to wet my sponge to blend out my concealer. And then with that damp sponge, I use my powder to set my concealer. But there's where we are. Still going. Still going strong. This is going to be in a while, I think. <laughs> so that one is staying in as well. Next, floral sofas. That was prompt number 15. Something with a floral pattern. And I chose my Physician's Formula All-Star Face Palette. And in this one, I chose the uh, Rose Petal Highlighting Powder there. Uh, my goal was to use that 10 times. I did. I used it 10 times. That can go out. But now my next prompt is the same palette. And it is for um, macrame, something with a lot of detail. So I chose in here this pressed powder to use 10 times. I use that 10 times. This is not a bad little powder. I don't like it under my eyes, but for everything else, it's fine. So I did use both of those, so those can go out now. Uh, next, pod chairs. A comfy product or something you use to pamper yourself yourself so I chose this uh, Bath and Body Works body spray Japanese cherry blossom you can see my marks where I started I started here I was here last time and let me mark it today stand still there we go There we go. Um, I like this. I love this scent. I forgot how much I really like it. This is my sister Teresa's favorite, I think. Yeah, I think this one's her favorite. But yeah, nice. This is to use up. So this is not going anywhere. Next prompt was Pyrex dishes. Something repressed. So I chose the contour that I frankened. That is in this palette. It's right here. My goal is to use it up. It hasn't budged. I must have really pressed that sucker hard. It's working great. I, I've got it on. Works great. Um, I don't know how long it's going to take me to use that up. But the goal is to completely use that up. So that might be in here a while. And then last was pleas pleasant. Peasant blouses. Peasant blouses. There we go. 
it's uh, something uh, or an inexpensive Inexp inexpensive product. God, got it out. Uh, I chose this little elf blush, just the blush side. I don't like, I don't like this highlighter. Not my favorite highlighter, so I just chose the blush side. I wanted to use it ten times. I did. I can roll that out. So now I've rolled out three products. So I'm going to roll three ones in with new prompts so prompt number 29 is exposed brick and that's a red lippy and so i'm gonna put in this besame 1964 lip it's a small one it's you know a little small one but i love this i have it on today beautiful shade i just recently pulled it out it's in my lipathon to use um what am I doing on the lipathon? Is it five times? I think so. But I'm putting it into this project as well. And in this project, I want to use it ten times. So ten times in this project, five times in my lipathon project. So there we go. I like it that well. I'm going to use it all fall. Uh, number 26, Chrome Finishes, a metallic product. I pulled out this topper I got from Ofra. It's an eyeshadow topper. It's in Glisten. It is so pretty. There we go. My goal is to use that seven times. This is, I'm going to use seven times. Since it is the 70s, I thought I'd go seven times. And then last, prompt number 46 is headbands. So it's a hair product. I have a stash of hair products. I'm so bad to buy a hair product, use it for a little while, get bored with it, buy new hair products. So I have all these partially used things all in my, um, under my vanity in my bathroom. And so I went through my, my basket of goodies and I pulled this out. This is the amazing, mix it up, the amazing blow dry secret. Uh, this lasts forever. I got bored with it and put it away. So my goal, my goal is to use this up. Will I accomplish that before, when did we start this? August of next year? Maybe, maybe not. But I'm gonna give it a college try. So let's mark this with my Sharpie. And there we go. I've got a lot of product to use. A lot of product. So, that's where I'm at. That's the new things I'm bringing in. I'm pretty excited. I'm enjoying this project pan. I'm not jumping on the bandwagon and bandwagon and doing a lot of project panning because um, it's a little bit overwhelming for me. But I am enjoying this one. Uh, so, guys, Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, it means a lot to me. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. That helps my algorithm. That helps other channel, other people find my channel. So I appreciate that. If you're new here, I would love it if you would subscribe and become um, one of my friends, one of my family. Uh, I have got so many wonderful, wonderful friends I have made. They're not subscribers, friends. So uh, I would love it if you would become one of those people. And any questions or comments, just leave them down below. Guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.